What's up guys? Welcome back. I, <clears throat> so today, uh, I know I, I was gonna put on the Denali front. I was talking about it on the post I made for you guys to saw, but uh, I still need the bumper and I can't find it. So for now, we're actually gonna go to a shop. I met this dude <clears> at <throat> the shop. He's been there for a while. Really good price. He's, right now, I'm just gonna get the whole truck sanded down. He'll take off all the dents, remove all the dents, cover up the holes in the bed. Leave it all nice and primed. Uh, we're gonna mold. The, he's gonna mold the wing. He's gonna mold the roll pen. So it's all gonna be ready for a paint job. So that's all we're gonna do for now. So we're gonna. We're actually on our way to the shop right now. My uncle. I don't know if you can see him. He's driving the truck. He's back there. <laughs> so uh, we're gonna make our way over there. And he said he's pretty quick. He said it was only gonna take him like two, three days at most. This dude, look what this dude's hearing. He's literally Cumbia Kings. <laughs> Cumbia Kings. So this dude right here, my uncle, I, he took off way. Look at what I don't know what he's doing. <laughs> he took off way before us. Good thing we told him where we were going. This dude was trying to race a freaking SRT8 Challenger, like if he even had a chance. <laughs> look at this dude. Damn, that's a sexy ride. <laughs> So I had bought a cheap third brake light from Amazon. Don't do that, guys. Look, it's already all broken. It's all chromed out because <laughs> the top layer fell out. So cheaper isn't always better, guys. But if you can do it cheap, you do it cheaper. <laughs> the shop but the dude is in here I messaged him already so he should be coming <clears throat> but uh well guys this guy's been open since 20 2008 so look at this dude <laughs> look at that damn that thing's badass and low <clears throat> but yeah he does uh he can basically do everything he showed me this truck yesterday it's been sitting here, but if it wasn't for the sun always hitting it, the clear coat would be badass. But look at that. The inside and everything. All custom, all badass. He told me it's more expensive on the inside because that's like plastic. It's different, it's more work. So let's wait to see if he comes. You wrote that quattro? <laughs> sorry I got my receipt guys it's gonna be a total of uh, 660 to like get the whole truck primed and everything all the dents removed everything and then post to get the the three handles in the mirror since they're like plastic it's different kind of work so 60 bucks extra I give 300 I only owe 360 so it's got I think it's a I think it's a good price it's a fair price he charges what he should what people should charge so I talked to him about the hood, the Vortec one. So he said it was 260. I just need a, he has a stock hood there. Sell it for sell it to me for 30 bucks and then just I bring the lid of the other one. So we can have the other hood in ready for when I want to put it on. And if I don't like it, well I guess I'll sell it to one of you guys. <laughs> so well tomorrow we're gonna stop by at the shop. He said by tomorrow it should be done, but like just need to prime it after that. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. So guys, next day. I actually uh, went to, to college classes and I was supposed to stop on the way over there because it's on the way back home. But I forgot the hinges that I took off from the Yukon. I have it right there. These right here. It's because the other ones on the truck are all bent and uh, the hood doesn't fit right like it does. But uh, like the corners of the hood 
on the truck they scratch constantly so you know it's just gonna mess up the paint if i put them on like that so hopefully these when i put them on they're gonna, gonna look straight here i have the girl right here i had wrapped these letters real nice that's the grill for the denali i just need the bumper and so we can put it on so uh, i'll meet you guys over there i'm here at the shop already um they've already done actually a lot and within a day they did a lot they have all this like already sanded down ready it's a bunch of little dents the fenders were messed up bad but they fixed them both there's a lot dense especially on the bed it was a lot <clears throat> that guy trying to race somebody so it was a lot of dents here you can see them the bed was the worst but they actually got it out most of it they covered the holes they had four holes here they covered them <clears throat> look at this and the the dude's gonna work on this try to make it smooth but look it's already gonna be part of the truck all badass also the roll pan we're gonna make it part also damn i'm so excited can't wait for them to have it finished it's gonna look freaking sick the big ass dent I had back here. They're slowly but surely getting it out of the way. So far they're doing some badass work. The truck is starting to look really clean. And that's what I like. Look, the bed. It's covered up with a bunch of that stuff. But yeah. So I guess I'll come back later. Hopefully tomorrow it's ready. Show you guys when it's done. Yeah, the stripe's gone. <laughs> 48 hours later. Okay, so what else do you need to do to it? Damn. Oh, I met your brother. The guy. It's kind of funny. He's already, he's, he's already seen my YouTube channel, so... So what? <laughs> Looks really clean, dude. I still can't get over it. When you sent me the picture of these, I was like, damn. I was showing everybody in my house. I've seen, I've seen these people and they do it wrong. Like you can see this big ass wall and then. Yeah, I've seen it. Like down and here. Everything in, so all this looks original, and like it just kind of blends. The in. line. It all fucking like blends in. I just notice the line. And they change the hinges. Doesn't hit anymore. So um, the truck should be ready tonight, so I can take it home. But. Um, I don't know if you guys noticed how he lined up the wing. Like, you know how the bed has like this little, sh this little sharp corner? He lined it up with the wing and also made the wing have that little sharp corner. So it looks like it's part of the body. The guy's for taking his time. He's trying to make it as straight as possible because the wing was kind of a little bent. He's actually paying attention to little details. The wing was kind of uneven, the gaps on both sides. He's gonna make them both like have the little gap. <clears throat> so this guy's doing badass work. The roll pan looks professional. Everything looks professional. I've seen some people when they mold on the wings, they just slap it on and just cover it. And you can see the freaking dents. Like they didn't even try to smooth it down and make it look natural. And this guy did also with the roll pan. He made it look like part of the truck. <clears throat> so uh, that's going to be it for the video, guys. Um, the paint job probably won't be coming along for like another two or three four months because <clears throat> i have a lot of stuff i need to uh do and i really don't have a lot of money to just throw in already but i'm gonna be in the windshield then i'll be in the front <clears throat> and once i will have the truck ready ready then you know i'll send it to the shop get a painter but uh that's that's it for the video guys i uh, hope you guys enjoyed it thanks for watching uh remember jesus loves you and god bless you guys